up y'all and welcome back to another one. Well, this one's actually part two. All of you are, that are here from the last magnet fishing video, I told y'all, get ready for part two, because we're here. Part two, take 15. <laughs> <laughs> but we're out here, we're at least, we're an hour and a half away from home, and we're making you a two or three part video series, magnet fishing video series. This is part two. We got a lot of random docks, just like that one right there. At least another 10 or 15 that we haven't hit. We're not gonna be hitting any bridges. We're not gonna be hitting any dams. All these docks are the same docks that any of you can use and go to and magnet fish or just regular fish. This is a complete public campground. So the next time you go camping, they just need to take their magnet with them. Take your magnet, take your kids, take your friends, take your mothers, your fathers get out any and all get out there man it's fun magnet fishing is something during the summertime that dad and i we've really grown to enjoy and believe me if we like it so much you guys will love it too i get a lot of questions about what magnets we run this is mine big old bertha 1100 pound pole dad he runs a 800 pound pole little tiny one uh -huh. disadvantage uh, disadvantage <laughs> he, he honestly does need to step it up i got one at home We've just been so busy building the lodge. Yes, my hunting lodge. Been so busy building it. But without further ado, we ain't wasting no more time. It's windy. I hope that it doesn't mess up the video. It, I mean, as you can tell, it's extremely windy. We're gonna get after it. I'm gonna put the gloves on. We're gonna get to dragging this magnet. Let's go. Well, 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 here we are. And uh, this is kind of a rickety dock as well. These docks, some of these docks where we're at, they have been here forever. And this lake that we're on right here, I can guarantee you it's got over 25, 30 docks on it. And it's not a big lake. Like I said, it's really windy, so I'm going to try to keep you guys out of the wind the best as possible. My, my best as possible, however you say it. Dad says it's deep and it drops off fast. So those are, oh yeah, woof. Ooh, yeah, it's real deep. It's right at eight to ten foot you're right wow that's deep now the thing is guys the deeper the water that means the heavier your magnet is down there and it's hard to really figure out when you do and you don't have something now if you get something heavy like you guys seen on some of our previous videos the deeper it is boy it makes it hard getting those big finds up so we're gonna give it a go today we might hit six docks who knows I went across this whole front of it. First pull up of the day. Hopefully I'm not jinxing myself. Anything over there? Nope. nope. Let's see if Bob's got anything. Am I lucky? Am I lucky? I'm not lucky today, Dad. That's all you. We're relying on you today. <laughs> well, it looks like they're having fun. Woo. See if we're having fun. Oh, we got something on now. Oh my goodness, look at that, Dad. Nothing but a ton of nails. Check that out. Man, I've been feeling a lot of stuff. Oh, that's yeah. not nailed. Ew. What that's is that? A, that's something that's cut up. For surely, isn't it? Yeah, huh. a whole bunch of something cut up. Yeah, looks like some bunch of metal of some sort. Oh, we'll, we'll keep searching here. Oh, there's something on there. Something on there. What is that? Check that out. That's just a piece of a dock. Old dock. Metal piece. Ugh. Well, there we go. <laughs> Nothing special yet. Just junk. Ooh, it's over here. What you got? What do you got? What do you got, Dad? Come on, we need something good. Oh, it's big. Oh, goodness. Here you go. Look at that. Oh, you look how you hooked it. You got it with the magnet and you hooked it as well. Look at that. Boy, howdy, we have found how many chairs now? How many has it been? Probably six this season? It has to be somewhere around there. Five, six, there we go. Old chair, she looks pretty beat up. I don't think she's gonna be reusable, Dad. I don't think she's reusable at all. Yep, oh yeah, she, yep, nope. Rest in peace, chair. There we go. Good find, Dad. 
That was a really good find. Heck yeah. That's the best find of the day. Dad's on the board. Wow. If you guys are new to the channel, Dad and I would like to get out here and make a little competition. Uh, I always tell you guys, if you can make something uh, a fair, good quality, positive competition, you're gonna find find some more stuff. You're gonna work harder to find to find things. You know what I'm saying? Don't give up. Keep at it. That's what Dad and I do. We we work over a dock until we think we've done picked or dry. You know what I mean? nothing another nail well here we go second dock of the day there's a lot of them a lot of them let me tell you this one's oh look at this one we got chairs way bigger this one looks like it's used a little more dad we even got a tube over here Somebody right left me a can of dr pepper it left us a party waiting to happen yeah yeah buddy i'm about to get on there it's getting <laughs> hot out Oh, and look at that. These are always good. Swim ladder. Oh, you know where I'm starting. You know where your boy is starting. Oh, it's real deep, Dad. Oh, good. It's like 12 foot. That is like 12 foot deep. Nah, what'd you get? Oh, another one. You found one of these on the last video. A purple one this time. Yep, the last one was an yeah. orange one. Nice fine dude it's been in there for quite some yeah. time look at him you're just loving it. a chair in this oh two of these yep we're we're set yeah. we're set we're gonna have to come back here i think we need to come back make make some actual you know fish and catch clean cook videos right here that. if you guys let us know i know you guys want to uh, this is what i'm thinking i think we need to take some of our old lures come back that we found come back and try to catch us some fish we'll we'll pick three lures a piece and See who catches what. Yeah, who knows? Dad, he's killing the game. Killing it. That's good news. Hopefully this dock's really good, you know? It's real deep, man. You can't tell if something's on there. Oh, we got something. We got something. We got more of that metal. More random metal. Dad is killing me right now. Oh, look it on there. Yeah, dude. What'd mm -hmm. you bring up? Bolt. Another big old bolt. You're the bolt king. <laughs> Check out what I brought up. I brought up a Bud Light Lime. I brought up a, ooh, an old, old, old Coors. Coors. That's cool. And then Miller Chill. Three different ones in one go. I'll take the Coors. Yep, yep. You got something big? Dad, he, he just went, ow! <laughs> Dad all of a sudden, ow! Bob, come here! Bubbles is coming up. Are we pulling it? You need my help. Oh, there you go. Oh, another yeah, old dock trash. That's what you probably, uh huh. Big old bolt. There's something bigger down there. Yeah. Oh, we got something. We got to something. Oh, look. I found a carabiner attached to a rope. Oh, look at that. A rope with a carabiner on each end. Look at that. That's a good find. Yeah. Definitely. Oh, that's a bungee. That's a big old bungee strap. Huh. Well, there we go. Reusable. Yeah, definitely reusable, maybe. Sorta, of, quite, maybe. Now, well, here we are. This one here. This is the one Dad and I spotted. And right when we seen it, we were like, whoa. Check out how big this is. Like I said, four boat slips. It's a complete plastic dock it's huge you think we're gonna have any luck yeah, if we're ever gonna have any really good luck out here i think it's gonna be on this one well the only thing i'm scared of is the moss hopefully there's not a lot of moss on the bottom here yeah there could be well there's only one way to tell let's roll boys uh it's like seven foot deep not bad Right at six to seven foot. Oh, it's a hard bottom. Oh, we're looking good, Dad. Oh yeah, I have a good feeling about this one. Ooh, what's on there? Oh, there we go. First bait of the day, and that is old. That is a very old bait. It's an old rubber bait that is hard as a rock. Look at that. I don't know what's what do you down got? there. I don't know what's Holy down there. Holy smokes. Man, there is just a bunch of stuff down in that one oh spot. Goodness. Yeah, Dad's been, Dad's been struggling. Oh, springs and 
My goodness, just tons of, tons of, tons of old metal. Dad's been working on something heavy down there. That's uh, crazy. On the other end. Your, your bigger magnet needs to be down there here in a bit. Well, we'll head that way. Oh, look at that. Just like you did, look at that. Look at all that, big old spring. This is where Dad cut all that junk that he was talking about, or that you seen earlier. Woo, that's a lot of nastiness right there, Dad. Wonder what all that is in there. Dad's got some, he's working on something heavy over here, gentlemen. Let's not bother him, huh? Holy cow, look at all that. That is a lot of junk, wow. One thing about magnet fishing, guys, look, there's a hook right there. It was buried in there, I wouldn't have seen it. You have to wear gloves. Make sure you wear some thick gloves. Save you from getting a tetanus shot. You got something? You've been working on it something over here. Like well, come on, bring her up. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, buddy, you do. Look at that. That's what you've been working on this whole time. Oh, man. man, look how old that is. That thing has been in there for. Looks like a hundred years. Yeah, it's been in every long time. Yep, just a big old rod, probably, probably something from an old dock. An old dock. Yep. Well, we're getting after it. This uh, this big old boat slip. There's so much to cover. Whew, I've just been chucking it and pulling it back right here. Holy smokes! Look at that. <laughs> look at that, dude. Just tons and tons of old springs and lots look at all these old springs it's the same stuff every single time what do you guys think this is i mean we're, we got a lot of this going on now what do you guys think this is drop a comment down below what's going on here what's down there honestly what what happened did a boat sink and it's just rotten away down there what is going on seriously here we are, same spot. Man, and there's a lot of stuff down there. I keep throwing it along there and pulling it back. Throwing it out there, pulling it back. I can tell we got more stuff on it. It's gotten pretty heavy yet again. Let's see. It's gotten quite a bit heavier. Sorry for the wind, y'all. It is extra windy. Oh, I got some stuff on there. Oh boy, look at this. What is all going on here? Look at that, Dad. <laughs> yeah there's a lot of stuff down there check that out that's a spring that looks like an old flag or something huh look at all this stuff what is down there my goodness rock pulled up a rock check this out look at this one i'm over there where all the junk is look that's a spring on top is that an uh, antenna uh could be an antenna maybe it looks a little yeah. thicker than an antenna right yeah that's not no antenna and then this look at this point on the end of that yeah i don't know interesting piece it's there's so much just junk of iron over there i keep pulling up tons of old springs and well check this out i was just telling dad hey let's go check that out. that's an old bait deal isn't it or no, that might just be a homemade anchor of some sort. It was on the bottom. It was on the bottom. Yep. Y'all drop. Oh, that might, that's a plug. It looks like a plug. That looks like a plug. If you guys know what that is, drop a comment down below oh, and let man, us know. It's in the lake. Yeah. <laughs> man, oh man. It is truly insane how many boat docks this place has. Uh, this is boat dock number. Oh. I thought those were ducks. Nope. Boat dock number four or five for this video. Crazy how many just nice boat docks, fishing docks like this there are here. There is a ton. Uh oh. Get for the virus. <laughs> Corona light, baby. <laughs> Man, that's one thing we've been catching a lot here. First one of the no, it's first or second one of the day today. But uh, there's a lot of beer tabs, tops around these docks. Them boys like to drink out here. Two girls tanning on a dock over there. They're probably like, what in the heck are these two fools doing? Just being fools. Oh, oh, oh. Uh oh, a little guessy guessy time, Dad. Beer top, what brand do you think it is? 
I always say Budweiser, but I'll say Miller's. Ah, uh, Michelob Ultra. Uh, that would that would have been a tough one. Ha <laughs> I win. All right, what do you got going on here? Your turn. What do you think this beer cap is? Mm, Bud Light. Bud Light. <laughs> Can't show me the color. I cheated a little bit. Gonna... <laughs> oh man. Yeah, buddy. Use you get use what you can get, boys. Oh, it's so mossy down there. Ugh. Oh, look at that. Heck yeah. Well, we haven't found that in a while. You'll never guess it. Fingernail clippers. Oh, I could use a pair of them about right now. Could you? <laughs> Your toenails long or what? <laughs> and a bottle cap. And, ooh, look at that. Old Coors. There we go. Huh. That's the best find on this dock yet. Yeah. For, for sure. I thought that this dock was going to be better, but... Man, it's it's uh it's not easy going out here, guys. You just got to keep after it, and uh, the finds do not come easy. Let me tell you. Oh boy, what are we getting ourselves into, Dad? What are you doing? I done talked Dad into into something here. So, as you can tell, we are not at the lake anymore. Uh, we had some decent luck at the docks. Uh, but not a ton. So we shut down the video while we were ahead, stopped wasting our time, and now we're here. This is a uh, this is a creek, and she's flowing really good. Now I don't know what we're gonna find, but a buddy of mine told me, "Hey Bob, you need to go check out this spot down on the creek. I fished there a bunch." Long story short, he said, "Back when I was a kid." A lot of people threw a lot of illegal things in there, whether they were stolen back in the day. I'm talking 20, 40 years ago. Uh, you can tell, check it out here. People like to come down here and fish, drink and not pick up their stuff. A lot of fishing, but right here, this is where we're at. This back in the day was better known as the sinkhole, he said. What do you think? I think you just wanted the old man to get some exercise and making me walk <laughs> two miles. <laughs> yeah, it's a hike back in here. But this right here is supposed to be insanely deep, like really, really deep. The old sinkhole. We're going to start chucking. Wish us luck. Yeah, it's a big old swirling hole. But check it out here. Look what dad got. Look at that shiny new piece of metal you got hanging there. You got her all rigged up. I'm getting broken in. Look what we're going into for the first time. Hopefully we don't lose it the first time out down there. Yeah, I bet there's a lot of rebar and stuff down there. That's what oh, I'm... Oh, yeah. Brand new 1,100-pound uh, pull magnet Dad got. Hooked him up. I'm you, used to that. Yeah, you'll start out fishing me now. That's what I'm scared about. I didn't want to give you that thing for a while because of that. <laughs> Let's get started here. Now we're both rocking the same 1,100-pound magnets. Let's go. Well, there's definitely stuff down there. There's a strange piece of metal of some sort. So I'm standing on my rope here and I am just literally having to chuck it as hard as I can to get it out there. Woo! Oh, I got something on there. Check that out. I got a really not a bad treble hook there. And then I got this piece of rebar a real thick piece of rebar huh well a little bit bucket material well i was afraid of that dad about lost his <laughs> you almost ended up in the water <laughs> poor guy it's a fishing hole not a magnet <laughs> oh here you go that was a close one she was about a goner <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's quicksand down there. Whew. Well, I just got hung up, got her, got her freed up, and checked that out. Another piece of rebar. My goodness, rebar in here. I figured, man. I figured. Well, I don't know about you, Dad, but <laughs> this is uh, honestly becoming a pain in my butt. What do we got there? We got a. We have a nut and a nail. Do you have anything? No. 
nothing but some caught magnets is about all we caught here. You can just about lose a magnet. Yeah, you're gonna lose a magnet real easy here. There's so many big rocks out here. Uh, Dad almost lost his over there. I almost lost mine here. Dad about lost his again. Uh -uh, I'm done. Messed up at all? You can tell. Just a little bit. Yeah. Look at mine. Mine was taped all the way up here. Look how thin it's getting. I had to yank it. And I mean yank it a ton. It's just all beat up and torn up now. I'm going to have to get a new rope here before too long. Yeah, it's, t yeah, it's time for you to have a new rope. Yeah. Woo! It's getting muggy, Dad. It's getting muggy, sweaty. The snake skin's starting to scare me. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big old snake, yeah. too. First thing we both thought of, Dad goes, Bob, I can guarantee you there's some big ass snakes down here. Yeah. Guaranteed. You can tell this is a really big hole out here because that current comes back this way and it pulls a, a, a 1200 pound magnet. Back yeah. This way. Whenever we pitch them out, the current's actually pulling them back this way. This is a huge whirlpool. So, me and Dad were just talking. I think we need to bring Bodie Harper out here, do a little catch clean cook video for y'all. I think it'd be fun. It's a good little spot and it's close to home. It's literally right down the road. If you guys want to see that video, you all have requested that dad and I get out there and do some fishing, some cooking together. If you want to see us get down here for some catfish action, I can guarantee you there's flathead and catfish in here. Drop a comment down below, let us know. But I appreciate you guys being here. Uh, we're on an adventure as we speak. Right when we shut down this video, we have a destination. We're going to go make another magnet fishing video for y'all. So stay tuned more magnet fishing to come y'all have been wanting them i know i've been busy working on my lodge and everything but they're back we're at least going to be bringing one to two a week so subscribe if you haven't hit that little notification bell down there because what will it do dad what will it, what will it do it will give you first notice for the first videos upload <laughs> it'll notify you when your boy uploads <laughs> <laughs> i love catching you off guard but until next time <laughs> I've been getting laid back, baby, you should know that I don't need your criticism, pessimism I've been keeping it on the DL, got a girl that keeps it real